Next up, we have his soulmate, his bestie, literally his other half. Hi friends, Marcy here, and welcome to my 80s crush list video. Y'all seem to love the Stray Kids one I did, so I figured why not do it for their besties, also known as my other ultimate boy group. So if you're new, <laughs> consider subscribing. It's a fun time here, I promise. And without further ado, let's get to the crush list. I don't know there's like an official crush list for anyone in the 80s, unlike the Stray Kids one where it all started when Chan had a crush list. So I'm gonna make one up. The disclaimer comes in. It's all a joke. Do know that I'm joking. It's a joke. It's satire. Depending on you, it might be comedy. Don't take this seriously, Chief. It's not that deep. So the first person we have up is Wu Young Gi. Funny enough, the first person on Wu Young's crush list is Chang Bin. If you've seen their interactions on Kingdom, just generally speaking, you would know. Next up, we have his soulmate, his bestie, literally his other half, Sun. Whoa! Enough said there. We have Jimin from BTS. That's a given, because he's literally the biggest army that I know of. Jimin, Jim. Aside from BTS, but still. We have Yesangi, his bestie of seven years. So that's a given. We have Sunkwa. That's just a given. I don't know what else to tell you there. We have Anthony. That's a given. We have Dancers. We have B2B. That's a given. Everyone in A sees those B2Bs. We have Block B. That's a given. We have Yeojun from TXT. That's a given. That's also his bestie. Then we have... <laughs> We have Felix, which honestly, their dynamic together, I love it. It's so cute. I want to see more Wu Young and Felix interaction. We have Sean Mendez, which I totally didn't know for some reason. We have gamers, because he likes playing video games. I don't know what kind of gamers or wh who, but he likes gamers. He likes Moonbin from Astro, because if I'm not mistaken, I think they're also friends. Did I say BTS? I think I did. But just in case, BTS, because again, he's the biggest army out there. I can't pronounce it. It's re hard. The heart ta. I don't know how to pronounce it. She was the woman, the girl, the bestie responsible for the iconic move in Pirate King for the survival show, codename Ats, and then loud people. So maybe extroverts, but also I'm an introvert and I'm a pretty loud person. So I mean, it could go either way. It was on the crush list, but just so y'all know, Ats is his crush list. Speaking of his soulmate, we have San's crush list. So number one at the top is Wu Young. I don't know what else to tell you. It's self-explanatory. We have Aties, that's a given. We have Anthony, that's a given. We have dancers, that's a given. Plushy collectors and sellers, because he loves plushies. If you know of his main iconic bestie plushie, Sheba, Sheba. I hope I'm saying that right. I could be just butchering it. Soft stance and Wu Young stance. BTS, I think that's a given as well. Cat lovers, because he has a cat, so that's a given. B to B, that's a given. Justin Bieber, funny enough, I never knew this. I don't know if he likes him now, but I mean, I guess he's a believer. I, I don't know, but he's on the list. Then we have my first ever boy group I ever stand. One Direction. In a clip, he kept saying like, One Direction, some mini, for some reason made me start crying. I don't know why, but it did. 1D besties, I guess, I don't know. Block B, that's a given. Icon, that's a given. So you best to believe when he found out Icon was gonna be on the show. He was happy out of his mind, essentially. And then we have Taekwondo students and teachers, cause he knows Taekwondo. Next up, we have Wu Young's bestie of seven years, Yes Sangi, who is currently an MC for. I forget what show it was. Is it the Music Bank or the show? First up, Emma Watson. If you've seen the clip for the survival show, you know exactly why. M. M. Oh. Emma Watson. Dead. Dead call. Dead call. So that was a real thing that actually happened. Chefs that cook like a five-star Michelin. Specifically, they specialize in chicken or fried chicken because he really loves fried chicken for some reason. I can't blame him. We have Wu Young, again, his bestie for seven years. ATs, he won't admit it, but AT, so that's a given. Anthony, that's a given. B2B, that's a given. We have snowboarders, because he likes to snowboard, funny enough. We have gamers. We have people who fly drones. 
I know there's like a specific name for that, but for now we're just call them people who like slash fly drones because again, if you've seen the survival show, when he played with his drone, he was such a happy baby and brought me so much joy and happiness that I could not stop smiling. Bakers. He really liked sweet foods. He was eating chocolate and the chocolate smeared all over his face and he didn't realize until like somebody pointed out or so like AT started laughing how adorable he looked. We have Taehyung from BTS, that's a given. Then we have Block B, which is a given. Next up, we have the man of the hour that we miss every single day. I think it was like last Thursday when we saw a picture of him and the boys going to an island and somebody's mowing their lawn outside. It was a blessful day for all of us because we missed him so much, especially me because Sunkwa and Wusun are causing havoc in my life and I miss my baby so much. Yunho, that's his bestie, that's a given. Yes, Dungi. Again, his besties, that's a given. Especially the whole 99 line, that's a given. 80s, that's a given. 80, that's a given soft stance because he might look intimidating on the outside but he's such a soft wholesome being that you want to wrap into a blanket with some stuffed animals eat some cakes some food and watch some anime and not watch some cute movies and k-dramas or some kind of funny videos <laughs> royalty that calls him princess because he likes the name Princess Minky, if I'm not mistaken. Fans are frozen too. Ghost hunters. If you know Minky, you know he is a big scaredy cat, like myself. If you hunt ghosts, or you know how to like get rid of ghosts and bad spirits or whatever, I'm sure he'll have a crush you and he'll love you for that because he is terrified of ghosts. Just go watch Survival Show and you'll see what I mean. B2B, that's a given. Jay Park. Rain, not the weather, but the K-pop idol that everybody and their mama is head over heels in love with, except for me because I don't know who he is. And then Express Impressively chaotic people. This can apply to extroverts, but can also apply to introverts. My mom really confirmed me the other month that I'm losing the only chaotic child that she birthed. So essentially he might have a crush on me and Speaking of his bestie, we have Yunho's crush list up next. First person, Minky, that's a given. 80s, that's a given. 80, that's a given. Stay slash straight kiss. If you watch Kingdom, you kind of understand why. That's a given. Dog lovers and owners. Because he has a nickname that he's a golden retriever or Labrador. A cute dog with a gold fur. The whole 99 line. That's a given. Harry Potter fans. I tried to figure out specifically which house of Harry Potter he was in. I looked on Twitter.com. I Googled. I did everything in my power that I could. We mini Antony don't know. Aties themselves don't know. I don't even KQ themselves they know. I know for me I'm a Ravenclaw but I don't know what house each member Aties is in depending on which house he's in. Each of y'all got a 24% chance of Yunho having a crush on you. If any of y'all do know what Harry Potter house Yunho's in as well as the other members let me know down below. B through B that's a given. Kai from EXO that's a given. Extroverts and energetic people. You have introverts with extrovert personalities then extroverts with introvert personalities so it could go either way you look at it. I put frat boys down. I don't remember why I put frat boys down. I had a reason, but I don't remember what it is. Why he likes frat boys or why he had a crush on frat boys. Next up we have the other magnet on top. We have Jungho's crush list. Woo Young, that's a given. Name a bigger Jungho stand than Woo Young. I will wait. 80s, that's a given. Jungkook Gi from BTS, that's a given. Apple Farmers, Monster X, he's a mom baby. Athletes, a gym people. Despite like he might have a baby face, he's the body of a man. Homeboy can pick up Woo Young. And Yoonho. Actors, especially cause he's in his own K-drama. I haven't seen it yet. Beat the beat, that's a given. Especially with the next episodes, I'm currently recording this. Black be, that's a given and then Hyunjini and the double O line is Stray Kids which by the way we miss you too sweetie ballad writers because he loves ballads would have loved ballads if it was a marching band Next up, we have the leader that's Loki also causing havoc in my life. Hong jong if you're wondering. We have B2B, that's a given. We have Black B, that's a given. We have Icon, you see the interactions with them. I don't know what to call it, but basically a song swap kind of thing. That's a given. Fashionistas and designers, because he's really known, well known for, at least to me, personalizing stuff, because there was one video, I can't remember what it was for, but he was personalizing a shoe brand. It wasn't Converse, I wouldn't know if it was Converse, because I'm a Converse girl. And then he designed his own phone cases, he could present his own shirts. I feel like he would love like fashion. He'd be like one of those people to go to fashion week just to see and get inspiration to like personalize and just DIY kind of things. You know what I mean? Sun Quad, that's his wife, so that's a given. 80s, his kids and his wife, that's a given. Producers and composers, so essentially three Racha. If you've seen the Kingdom episode, you know exactly why I said that. I don't even know they still exist now thinking about it. If you're a Minion fan, Hong Jong has a crush on you, low key. G Dragon, that's a given. Zico, that's a given. Anthony, that's a given and then I feel like people who can help him if not people who like his sense of humor you can even call it that that's up for the bait 
And last but not least, the bias burger that's with constantly having in my life since the moment I met him, Sung Kwa, also known as Hong Jung's wife. First on the crush says Hong Jung, that's his husband, so that's a given. Astrologist? I forget why exactly, but they're on the list for some reason. B2B and Melodies, if you've seen the iconic clip where he was low key crying watching B2B's performance for the first round, you'll understand why. Lock B, that's a given. People who have Mars as one of the zodiac planets. K drama lovers, he loves watching K dramas so much that he's in a K drama, so. ASMR lovers, congrats to y'all. Sunkwa, honey, I love you, but I cannot do ASMR for my life. 80s, that's a given. 18 that's a given. People who collect action figures or figurines. Whether it's action figures or like anime figurines, I don't know. Last two are kind of self explanatory. We have Felix, because it's Felix. He says he loves Felix because the personality on stage versus personality off stage, and just Felix as a whole, and wants him like his little brother or wants to be his, like his big brother to him, something like that. And I'm over here just going that's cute and i love that at the same time though you'll have to talk to my husband about that because no one loves that boy more than chan does i would know i'm married to him but he loves that boy more than he loves me and i'm not mad about it honestly because i love that boy too yeah and then we have also jungian but i think that's a general rule of thumb everybody loves jungian he really is the magnet on top and that ladies and gentlemen was my 80s crush list. How I feel about it, I feel like I was pretty spot on with this. If you think I'm missing a person from any of the crush lists that I read, let me know down below in the comment section. So with that being said, this is the end of the video. If you liked it, please leave a like. That lets me know the kind of videos you guys like to see on my channel. Again, comment down below if I'm missing anybody from any of the crushes I read. I'm sure I missed a few people, but I think I got everybody. While you're at it, subscribe and notifications just turned on. Social media, which is TikTok and Twitter. React on both of those, so go check those out. But until next time, I hope this video would you feel better in so much shape or form and i will see y'all in the next video whenever that is bye